All right, so what is going on everyone? Swan here, and today we are actually back on MLB The Show, and I think I, if all goes well, I'm not sure, but tomorrow I might post a Fortnite video. Not, not 100%, not 100% at all, because I don't know if I'm actually going to be playing that much tonight because I got a lot of stuff to do, but uh, here we are playing some head-to-head. -head. I played another, so I uploaded the video yesterday in head-to-head -head where I won, and I got pushed up to like 860-something for rating, and now I'm at 887, and this game could put me in the World Series division if I do win. But it's not guaranteed, it might put me at like 899, 895, somewhere in between that range. So, uh, who knows what's going to happen, but anyways, let's get this started and let's see if we can win a game real quick. I'm actually going to make that tweet, I forgot to tweet yesterday, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to ask if people want to see some Fortnite because... I've been playing that. I've seriously been playing the game so much, and I, I think it would be really fun to make a video. So I'm gonna ask real quick and see if anyone would like that while we're searching this game because it's taking a while. I think because my rating is really high and it's right on the verge of World Series that uh, it's kind of hard to find a game to match. And it looks like we did find a find an opponent. All right, we found someone finally. Here we go. Same squad as last time. We got switch hitter, switch hitter, lefty, righty, switch hitter, righty, lefty, righty and then a random pitcher. And let's see, it looks like I am, I think I'm the host of this game, so it's gonna be nice for the connection wise. And, come on, and it looks like I am the home squad, and we got Vita Blue pitching, and he's got uh, only 199 overall, which is Mike Shoup, his created player, and it's the Michigan Wolverines, and he's got uh, Luis Castillo, Luis Castillo, I don't know how you pronounce it, uh, but anyways, uh, tough pitcher matchup. I'm pretty sure Castillo has a ridiculously hard fastball. I'm pretty sure he throws gas, so I don't know how tough it's gonna be. And I think he does actually throw a sinker, if I remember right, from the Future Stars cards that were released. I never really got many of the Future Stars cards because uh, I didn't really feel like a need to finish the mission and get the Yoan Mankata card because uh, it's just I just didn't feel like it was a very good card. So. Uh, Francisco Lindor is the first up to bat, so let's see if we can uh, get them out of this inning. That's a fastball right down the middle to start the game, and it looks like, hold on, I got a DualShock battery low, got to plug in the, uh, the charger, and now let's see if we can get Lindor with a nice curveball, that was a filthy curveball, and this, this person's like, I think it was 32 and 29 or something. Uh, so he's not too great, and it looks like we're just gonna strike him out right away. Jacoby Ellsbury, let's go with the high curve ball. Interesting pitch choice from me. I don't know why I'm doing that, but figured why not. He's swinging and missing a lot. Let's try and throw a nice little hard fastball up and in at him. It's gonna get him, and I feel like we're just gonna get him with this curve ball. Easy money. Probably should have thrown a change up, but that's a filthy curve ball, and that's gonna get him, and that's already two strikeouts in a row. So. That's pretty solid, and then now we got his 99 overall player up. Only a 268 average. He's got the Griffey stance, switch hitter, I'm sure. I'm sure he's not just a righty Griffey uh, hitter. But anyways, let's see if we can blow a fastball right by him. And then, yep, okay, 97. I didn't really notice that he could throw it that hard. Uh, but anyways, here comes by this curveball. His nasty curveball, that's not gonna get him. That was an awful pitch. Let's throw a nice little change up. Get him a little off speed. If if this misses, I'm throwing a fastball. Okay, I'm gonna throw a fastball, even though he is really early on it. Um, Jesus, he only hit that 33 miles per hour off the bat. Little fastball, gets him with the third strike. Nine pitches, probably could have had an immaculate inning if I wanted to right there, um, if I threw more strikes. But anyways, here we go. Uh, he does have a sinker. I think this is the pitcher that I was thinking of. Throws very hard, and he is. I can tell that that was really hard. He threw 98. Okay, 98 off the bat, and he's just warming up. So that's not what I like to see. 93 mile an hour sinker. We got the Casey Swan batter up. The created player. Let's see if he can give me something to rip. Nope. Little slider down a little bit too low. Got to be patient. And I'm talking a lot, kind of running out of breath. And that was not a good. Not a good swing right there. He's throwing mostly balls right right now. 
Uh, I don't know what I'm doing chasing. And that is going to be hopefully out of play, but it's not not even close really. I uh, threw a high and away fastball pretty hard. Uh, couldn't really get a hold of that one. He threw it 98 again. But now we get Carlos Beltran up. Come on, let's get it. Let's get ahead early. We got to get ahead early. He's gonna throw a little slider inside. Come on, Beltran. Come on. Ah, sinker. That, that's such a hard pitch to hit when they throw it in. It looks like it's just going way in, but really it just ends up right on the inside edge. Um, and there, there again, dude. The sinker got me. I went a little. I went too high, and that would have literally been a home run if I just kept it right there and swung at a good at a good time. Back to the two and two counts. Come on, give me something to hit. Stop throwing these. He's he's being like uh, tactically wild. Like he's he's pitching good. I feel like he's pitching good even though he did leave one right down the middle. But uh, two and two again and Beltron rips it down the line a little bit early though. I hit it 102 off the bat and he's going to throw a sinker and that's going to Carry somewhere? No, it's not. He's gonna make a really weird turning catch uh, with his lefty out in left field. But now we got Joe Mauer up. Come on, give me something. I wanna, I wanna get a good hit. Joe Mauer. This is where he used to play when he was super good. So he's gotta show up this game. He's gotta show up this game. Come on, let's go, Joe. And that's gonna be ball number two. Gotta, gotta just keep taking. Joe's a patient hitter, so only swing at the ones that you really want. And I really wanted that one, but it was a good pitch. A little change up on the outer edge. Uh, two and one. And Mauer's gonna fly out too. Jesus, come on. All right, well that's gonna be the end of this inning. But let's let's get him let's get him on the mound now. And there's strikeout number four, three. I don't know for Stanton or against Stanton. Now we got Justin Morneau up. And that could be a pop out. Come on, Maurer. Oh, diving catch for Maurer on his former teammate. These are both the Twins version cards though. So it's funny because they really are teammates in this. Uh, back when they were both just unreal. And there's another strikeout. Jesus. This is just too easy right now. This this is I, I feel like the rating on this team is pretty low, so I'm probably not gonna get to the World Series division with this game, but I don't know, we'll see. Oh get out of here. Get out of here, Bagwell. Please. Off the wall. Off the top of the wall. I hit that I feel like I hit that perfectly with my PCI, but I don't know. I got around on it. It was a 97 mile an hour fastball, it just somehow didn't get out. And Elmar's gonna ground out. I'm hitting really aggressive right now. Oh, that's gonna get through. A oh, hard, hard chopper. Right to the shortstop. And I'm gonna get a little base hit and get to first. Solid. And Brooks might. Is that a home run? No way! Another one off the wall! I'm gonna send him... Actually, we're gonna keep Brooks at uh, second because he doesn't got a lot of speed, but that scored, uh, was it Ripken? I think Ripken from first, so that's huge. Now we got Vita Blue up. Let's see what he gives me. And Vita's gonna get around on it, but it's not gonna get past the second baseman, and that's gonna be out number three. And I'll take that now. Let's get back on the mound. We're throwing a no-hitter right now. Not too worried about jinxing it. It's just whatever, so... Let's just keep playing. And there's another out. Fly out to Griffey. No! Broke up my no-hitter in this inning. Maybe I did jinx it, but whatever. Uh, he ripped it down the line. Absolutely demolished it. I don't know how to pitch to Gary Sanchez. I feel like every every card I face of Gary Sanchez, he just somehow gets hits off of me, home runs, especially home runs. And I don't know, if you're playing me, just put, put Gary Sanchez in because I don't know how to pitch to him. All right, there's out number three and we already made him quit. Okay, I will, uh, Take that. That's how that's how you start a game, I guess, and that might put me in the World Series division. If it does, I'm going to be very happy. Please give me at least 13 rating. It gave me 7 and I'm at 894. 
Dang it. I might have to open up some packs just to just to open up some because I just feel like that was super quick. Uh, so we might as well just go do it. I have packs. I have packs to open. So uh, let's open up this hundred set pack. We're going to open up 20 of them. Just 20. Uh, save the rest for later. But anyways, here we go. Let's see what we get. Come on, give me a good topper. This is, I haven't opened up packs in so long. And we got a bond as a habit. Oh, it just gives us a random one of those. I thought it gave us like actual toppers. Okay, well, uh, where's that ball and as a habit pack? Oh, it's, it's in the middle. Okay, we're gonna open up that right away. I have gotten a random diamond out of one of these, which is pretty crazy. Um, Carlos Santana. Okay, yeah, there, there was no one in that one. Uh, we're gonna open up, okay, these first set one and two, and then one pack from set three. So we got 10 of these, we got 10 of set one, then we got nine of set two, and then we're just gonna do one of set three. So, um, nothing in that first pack. That was kind of a, easy quick game so ba that basically guarantees not not entirely but uh if i win my next game in head to head it's gonna send me to the world series division so that's pretty exciting and uh that actually ends in six days so we still have like a ton of time maybe even if we did lose i could easily just play a few more games like i can guarantee 100 percent i'm gonna be in the world series division and we got a goal did we get the rookie david wright card we did! Okay, that is actually dope. Uh, I, I, isn't that one of the special cards? Yeah, rookie flashback David Wright. That's huge. I'm gonna check how much he's worth after this. Uh, but I've like, I've never packed one of the special cards from the sets. Uh, the specific sets that allow you to get some special cards. So, that's huge and I'm happy about that. Whatever, we got four more packs in the set number one. And let's see if we can get another one. Maybe we can get that. Is it Roberto Alomar that we can get? Uh, yeah, rookie legend Roberto Alomar. So we got the rookie flashback David Wright. I don't, I doubt it goes for a lot, but I feel like it's a pretty rare card. Is that Billy Burns? I'm going to guess. No, Ozzy Smith. Okay. Uh, Ozzy Smith is not worth, I, I think I've gotten that card before and I think it's like less than a thousand or might be a thousand. I'm not sure. Um, no one in there. Here's the last pack from set one. And we're gonna get a gold division or gold sponsorship card. We got a rookie Adam Jones. I'm calling it Billy Butler. Okay, that was like the one, the two cards that I expected it to be. Um, but now we're on to set two. I forgot to check which cards we could specifically get. The special cards: Hardware Flashback Chris Bryant. Don't really want it. Rookie Flashback Noah Syndergaard. That would be pretty nice. I'm pretty sure he's worth a decent amount because it's Syndergaard and he throws hard and he's a tough pitcher to hit. Uh, Syndergaard is actually really hard to hit. He's one of the best pitcher, one of the best live series players in the game, I think, for your starting rotation. Um, Neil Walker, Jason Vargas. Okay, we got six more of these. We got seven more total packs. It's it's been a good pack opening so far already. We've gotten some pretty cool people. Adani Echeverria on the Rays now. Everyone left the Marlins now at this point. It's kind of sad. D was traded to the Mariners, and now he's a center fielder. Uh, Stanton to the Yankees, Ozuna to the Cardinals, Yelich might go to the Braves now, and if Yelich goes, I don't think it's, see, I don't think he's been traded yet, but if he is, that's just absolutely ridiculous, like, they, they've lost everyone at this point, um, so they're, they're really trying to rebuild, like, from the ground up from below the ground up that's what it seems like uh three more packs we got two more of the set two packs and it looks like we're gonna get a silver we're gonna get jose batista only an 80 overall nowadays it's kind of sad to see um no one in this one dansby swanson a future star and then right next to him victor martinez the 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 veteran uh now we can get we're just opening one more pack and this is the set three. We can get breakout legend Edgar Martinez and breakout legend Bob Feller. So, give me something. First pack from this set. We got a gold, uh, gold glove, huh? That's funny. Gold, uh, batting gloves. And we got Mark Trumbo, but that's it. And now let's go check how much this David Wright card costs. Because, because, um, what am I trying to say? I don't know how much. I don't think he's going to be worth that much. So let's go flashback. Um... Rookie, where's, wait, did I pass rookie? There's rookie. Flashback rookie. 
And he's worth 9k! Okay, I might as well keep him. I think I'm just gonna keep him. Jesus, that Chapman card is up to 200,000? What? That, that's that's more than his regular card. Hold on, let me let me see this. Um, take that off. Let's go live series. Uh, closing pitcher. Yeah, he's worth 50k. And I'd much rather have his older, more mature one where he has more control and everything. But, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Drop a like if you guys did enjoy. We're working on getting towards the World Series division. We're getting there. We're getting there. Real close. Just one more game and I'll be fine. Uh, but anyways, yeah, like I said, drop a like if you guys did enjoy. Subscribe here if you were new. And as always, I hope you're all having a nice day. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out, everyone.